When we first came here, the garden really was a mess. It was like a wilderness. But we laid it out according to a proper design. The bricks you see should go off into eternity. So that's one dimension. And then we had this circle of the four worlds. And at the center is what's called an armillary sphere, which is the earth at the center with the zodiac around it. The, I made this, it's made out of a, a stair post and the bottom are two terracotta dishes, which are riveted into the bottom there. And it's quite movable. Uh, and then we have the fairy path. We leave that back wild so that the nature spirits have a place. So the general garden is there, plus the apple tree. Uh, the interesting thing is this apple tree is of russet apples, which are Rebecca's favorite apples. So this was the real clincher that Providence had actually organized it very well. There's an interesting Jewish story about uh, it was Yom Kippur and Rabbi Cohen was mad about golf, mad about golf. And he went up early in the morning, he was playing a round of golf. And Elijah said, Holy One, look at Rabbi Cohen on the morning of Yom Kippur, he's playing golf. You know, what, what a sin, what a sin. Yes, yes, yes. He said, well, are you going to punish him? He says, watch. And Rabbi Cohen started to strike a hole in one. Holding one. Worked on the whole course, holding one. And Elijah said, This is a miracle, but you know, you know, how are you punishing this? Who could he tell? <laughs> That's called cause and effect. And punishment is always suitable. So if you ever get a black eye, you've got to say, Why did I get a black eye? Why did I get a right black eye against the world? A left black eye against. And that's what the Kabbalist does. He always says, Why is this happening? Just the beginning of the world, because we live in an epoch which I say marked by the rise of Hitler or totalitarianism, the change from the age of Pisces to Aquarius. There's a massive shift we can see going on. Now, this teaching is vital because it's essential to this is what existence is about. And if that's ever lost, then we revert to savagery. Mm -hmm. And there are various people here who everybody I know here, actually, everybody I know here has taught me something. So it hasn't been just one way, it's been two ways. So all of us have different jobs and there are different people in different disciplines here. And what is interesting is like you put a, a drop of scent and it spreads slowly. So I want to say thank you to all of you for carrying out what was my particular mission because you can then carry it on long for us after the after we've gone. And for that I, you know, I would say to everybody, to down and back. Mm -hmm. Now for the real work. Mm -hmm. The one with the cameras. Is that such a good <laughs> From all of us, Warren, with the deepest admiration, respect, and affection, happy birthday.